Hello, my YouTube friends! I'm trying out Gordon Ramsay's chicken parm recipe today. And I'll also be making a simple pasta sauce. I'm done slicing my chicken breast to make it double the size. So here I am rolling the chicken to make it nice and even using my rolling pin. I always make sure that I wash my hands properly after every handling of the chicken. And disinfect your work area. Look! Two yolks! They say it's a rare phenomenon and happens in roughly 1 out of 1,000 eggs. Amazing, right? I added salt, pepper, dried parsley, garlic powder, and parmesan cheese into my breadcrumbs. So here I am, got the flour, egg wash, and breadcrumbs ready. First step, I'll start coating my chicken with the flour. Step 2, I'll be moving on to the egg wash, making sure that the chicken is properly coated. And finally, to the breadcrumbs with all the parmesan cheese and spices we added into it to make our chicken really taste good. I did several recipes for breading chicken in the past, but rolling the chicken again is actually very useful. This is a very impressive technique by Chef Gordon Ramsay. I like it because the breadcrumbs stick to the chicken. I will definitely use this kind of technique from now on. A big thumbs up for me! Now moving on to the pasta. When the water starts boiling, I added about a tablespoon of olive oil and a pinch of salt. I'm using Ghirandoli pasta for today, which cooks for about 5 minutes. For my sauce, I minced about 6 garlic cloves and sauté them. I am using 2 bottles of basilic sauce and cook it for about 5 minutes. I am also adding in some spices like dried oregano, dried parsley, salt, and pepper to taste. With my pan hot and ready, I lay down that beautiful breaded chicken. When the sides of the chicken starts to brown, add little pieces of unsalted butter. Cooking time will be two and a half minutes per side. Now we're ready to flip the chicken and cook the other side. I added some sauce underneath the chicken and here I am putting some mozzarella cheese. I preheated the oven to 200 degrees Celsius and I'm baking this for about 15 minutes or until the cheese melts. And here is our chicken parm recipe by Chef Gordon Ramsay. Wow! This dish smells really good! It's plating time! My family loved and enjoyed this recipe. The chicken tasted absolutely delicious! I will certainly make this recipe again, especially using the double rolling technique. Try this easy and delicious chicken parm recipe by Chef Gordon Ramsay. Thank you for watching! Bye!